up next, it is a featherweight matchup between Max Holloway and Jose Aldo. Well, what else can you say about Jose Aldo Jr.? Strong ground game, knockout power is there. Some of the best leg kicks in UFC history. Representing Nova Uniao, Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Still the man considered by many to be the greatest featherweight in the history of mixed martial arts. So here's the undisputed or tail of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Aldo is five years the elder. Holloway is four inches taller. Aldo will have a one inch reach advantage. Here once more is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC and the weight division. It's an easy push. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer, holding a professional record of 27 wins, four losses. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, presenting the former UFC featherweight champion of the world, Jose. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 20 wins, three losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Wyatt Eye, Hawaii, Max Lewis Hall! All right, Griffin, the rules are locked, man. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times, on a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back to your corners, come out fight. All right, here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after it. You ready? You ready? And we are ready to go with live action from Toyota Center here in Houston, Texas. And a great champion like Aldo will lull you to sleep and then explode on you. And there's a nice jab by Holloway. Show your thoughts on what we might see here. Wow! This could be it! Oh, look at this! Who saw that coming? Oh! Massive head kick there. We'll oh. see if he can finish. Oh! He's picking him apart. Nice leg kick. That punch, no good. Look at that. Nice. Oh, there's the kick right underneath the elbow. Able to land to the body there with the left kick. There's a nice straight right hand. <laughs> Head off the center line, slips the punch. Oh, he got cracked with the jab there, Joe, and his head is firmly on the center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He's showing some vulnerability here by leaning right into his opponent's range. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Just a slip there. How about that shin? These guys are swinging. <laughs> Just missed with that huge kick. That one hurt. Oh, nice. Tagged him again. Aldo going for the takedown here, but he misses. Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. Now circling to his right, trying to avoid those big shots from his opponent. Head kick attempt, unable to find the target. Aldo gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. Oh, 
Solid jab. She slips the punch nicely there. And he lands the roundhouse. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Jose Aldo with a vicious leg kick. Well, he just missed on another strike there. He has not been efficient with his attack here tonight. And offensively, I think his approach leaves a lot to be desired. Got to figure out a way to conserve some energy here moving forward. Hook to the head, lands flush there by Max Blessed Holloway. Good combination there by Holloway. Oh, he countered nicely there to land the left hook, Joe. And he's looking for that left. Oh! next. Archer, right, so there's the horn at the end of the round. He got knocked down just before the horn, so he'll walk back to his corner here. We'll see if they can get him physically, mentally back into the fight. What a moment at the end of that round. Here's a perfectly placed kick that results in a knockdown. Let's see it one more time. The beautiful. Okay, you ready? Round two. Ready? Round two here. He's definitely going to want to start. Wow! He's got him right here. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Oh, he might be out. Hard overhand punch. Oh! What a leg kick. Oh, straight right. Yet another nice leg kick there by Holloway. Oh, a lot of volume here. Good series of strikes there. Well, you know these leg kicks, Joe, are a big part of his arsenal, but I'm not sure he's been any better with it than he is here. Oh! This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. He's got him hurt here. Oh! Huge right hand! So, fighter a little bit stunned, holding on to him now, not doing a ton, just looking to recover. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more... Whoa! He's out! He's out! It's out! Oh, do it! What a performance by Max Holloway. That was excellent timing here to land a big left hand to stop the fight. Yeah, Joe, a near-perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week, played out here on fight night, he found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. Check it out here. Boom! And then he's out. And there he is after the huge knockout turned in tonight. Near perfect execution and one of the bigger highlights of his UFC career. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Lugliotta has called a stop for this contest. At two minutes, 24 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Max Bless So congratulations to the UFC featherweight champion, Max Holloway. He so embodies Hawaii's fighting spirit, and this guy's just getting going. Still on the right side of 30, the winning streak of double digits, absolutely incredible, and Max Holloway at his efficient best here tonight in defense of his 145-pound title.